Hey guys, it's Claire and I'm back and today I'm going to do January favorites video since everybody's doing it on YouTube I might as well do it as well because I have a few favorites that I'm loving this month and I wanted to share it with you guys So let's get started So let us begin with makeup I am loving these two right here. I bought it together and these are the MAC lipstick and lip liner set so it was bought together and the sales lady said I would save five dollars or something so I bought it and this is the shade <laughs> okay sorry and this is the shade top and it's like a nude um, natural lip color and I've been into that a lot I have like a lot of similar shades in different brands and the lip liner it came with is the shade Hover and it's more on the browner side top it has a little um, nude color pinkish color next is this liquid lipstick by Siate London and I got this from my Ipsy bag in December, I think and it's a really cute um, rosy color and I like this liquid lipstick because it's really creamy and it's not too dry on your lips and I love it next product is these two right here and this is a Neutrogena Hydra Boost uh, water gel and the Tarte Maracuja oil so I've been using these two products a lot lately for this month because I've been having really dry skin so these two helped a lot and I use um, this on my whole face every morning and night and this right here I use this on um, my eyelids and um, it's been helping a lot lately I used, I've been using these two for about a week and it's been helping a lot um, hydrate my face and it's getting better at the moment and this is the first time I used foundation in a while so it, it's not doing that patchiness look anymore and it's blending into my skin and so that's a thumbs up and I bought this like for like 14 or 15 dollars and it's worth it because it really helps with your face Next product is this negative or minus 417 hand cream and I got it from my Ipsy bag. I have no idea where to buy this. Like I look online and it's on different websites, but I don't know if I should trust those websites anyway. And it's really um, moisturizing to my hands. It actually has like dead sea salt or something like that and it really nourishes your hands. And I can talk about the same thing over and over like I do in my essays. I think I use most of it and I'm almost out of it and the fragrance is not too strong so for those of you who don't like strong scents in anything this is good for you next thing that I like is actually a color it's rose gold I've been addicted to rose gold for about two months now and every time I see rose gold I just like walk straight to it and like glance at it and admire it and my friend actually gave me this as a present Christmas present and it's a rose gold um, I don't know what you call this but you can use it to hold down your paper um, whatever you want it to hold down and it has like this velvet thing on the back and it says dream which is very inspirational. Thank you, Robin, for giving this to me. And I plan to like use it as a background or in a backdrop when I get my room organized in the future. I will be using it. The next thing that I've been loving this month are chokers, and they're all in this Ipsy bag right here. I know I keep talking about Ipsy, but yeah, I love Ipsy. And so I have a lot of chokers. I got from Icings, from Forever 21, and every other store that sells chokers to buy the cashier. Literally, that's why I have a lot. So one of my newest chokers is this right here. It's lavender and it has this cute pendant in the middle. Makes you feel like a princess and I've been loving it. This daisy choker right here. This one is also one of my favorites. It's a lace kind of choker with gold chains hanging on it. And I've been using this in some of my videos. These are my other chokers. So um, there's two right here that's tangled into each other. Oh no, I think they're good. Okay, so I got some gold ones and I got some basic ones in different colors. And this one I've been using a lot lately when I'm going out with my boyfriend or go shopping. 
it's like a burnt red orange kind of color with gold. so i've been loving fuzzy socks this month and last month and uh i've never worn this before like i wasn't never i was never into fuzzy socks before but since um i went shopping with my friend she bought fuzzy socks i wanted to copy her and buy fuzzy socks too and ever since then i started loving it and so these are from bath and body they have penguins on it and it said that it's infused with shea butter i think and same goes for these I bought these at TJ Maxx and they were about five dollars so yeah these are so soft the next products that I've been loving are these cat ears right here so I have three of them these two I bought from icing spy players and this one right here I bought from forever 21 so um this one is rose gold and this one is gold oh and the cute designs inside is like diamonds so um, I bought these at Claire's and they had like a buy three, get three free in the, for the entire store and I decided to pick these two up. And ever since then I've been using them for like videos or when I go out with my boyfriend or go out shopping and yeah, it's really cute. It makes you look really cute and young. So yeah, really love these. I've been loving is this Too Faced Sweet Peach Eyeshadow Palette and I had it for about two months. And I'm still like new at doing eyeshadows. I'm not a makeup artist or anything like that, so I'm still like practicing on how to do um, eyeshadow, makeup, whatever. And I don't know if you can tell, but I did my eye makeup today. And the eyeshadows that I've been playing around with a lot are Puree, Summer Yum, these three right here, these two right here. And Bellini, Trans, I'm sure, and Delectable. And those are the shades I am using right now at the moment. Um, uh, I'm not sure about these two right here. Like, they do nothing to me. Like, when I watch Cassie's video, like, she pointed out these two. And I think this as well, that it does nothing on her face, her eyes. And I totally agree with her. And this palette right here is like 30 to 40 dollars so I had to make sure that I like every single shade so yeah I looked at it and I liked all the shades here I could see myself using all these shades here and yeah it's really cute it smells like peach and stuff so when I got it I was really happy with it but the only letdown in this palette is the mirror Okay, the mirror is very narrow and very small because it's covered with this thing right here and it's not really clear. It's kind of like a mirror you see in a little girl's toy. So I would use like other mirrors except for this one to do my makeup. So yeah, that is the only thing that I don't like in this palette right here. Next thing I've been loving this month are off-shoulder tops and I only have a few here because I don't really have that much outgoing clothes. Anyways, this is one of them. This is a red floral. It's kind of see-through but I love it. So yeah, this has these little straps that go on your shoulder so it's not really off-shoulder but yeah, you get the drip. I like it and it has lace on the ends right there. Okay. And the last one I have this right here. It also has the same kind of style as the previous one and yeah, it has lace and it's a cute little cream color. I also bought one for my mom when I went shopping for off shoulder clothes because I think she will look good in those kind of clothes. So yeah, I bought some for my mom. The next thing I've been loving this month, I don't actually have it right now because I'm broke at the moment and I don't have money to buy anymore. It's the Vita Coco Coconut Water and I'll just post a picture here that I posted on Instagram yeah so if you know me personally I really don't like coconut I don't like cantaloupe I don't like watermelon and I used to love them before but lately when I try eating it or drinking the juice from it it's been making me feel nauseous so if you're asking me why do you drink coconut water well I've been having dryness problems this month so I bought the coconut water to see if it really helps you hydrate and stuff like that so I bought it and I really actually like it if it's like really really cold so I've been drinking it a lot when I had money 
it really does help. It was clearing my face and it was making my face hydrated and stuff like that. It was really good. But the only thing that I don't like about it is that it makes you go to the bathroom every 30 minutes or an hour. So, yeah, that's the only thing I don't like about that. The thing I've been loving is on my phone. It's an app. It's Pandora. So it's kind of like um, a radio. It's kind of like Spotify or like whatever. So you can choose your favorite genres, your artists, or albums. And it will play similar songs like it. And lately I've been loving it. This is my small list I have right now. I don't like... I'm, I'm still new at it. I still have a little bit. So lately I've been listening to R&B love songs. And hip hop and pop. Drake and Camila Cabello and the Chainsmokers so yeah that is the songs that I've been listening to lately and I also like Bruno Mars songs yeah so that's it so that is it for my January's favorites hopefully some of the products that I like you like and if you do comment down below how much you love it and um, if there's any products that you would like to suggest to me for my drinks that would be helpful as well thank you for watching hope you guys like the video and subscribe to my channel floral kind of top it's backwards hold on how you doing how you doing how you doing And top is like a nude. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna stick with what I had earlier. <laughs> so bright. So bright, I can tell. And it's getting too bright sorry and I just started putting a little I can't talk I can't talk I can't talk the Seattle language oh we gotta get here I've been using together and the late the sale said that I'll be